What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. Back in wedding mode, back in another venue we've never been to in North Carolina. Man, this is just how it is these days. I mean, we're going somewhere new almost every other weekend, lots of places popping up. This place is about an hour from Raleigh. It's gorgeous, it's a gorgeous day. It's called Cornelius Properties. And I think this is Birdsong Chapel that we're in. And then over where the actual party is, room called the Carriage Hall or Carriage House or something like that. So that's a little further up the path. And then there's a lot of little places around here to stay if you're getting married here. So that's super cool as well. But we're ready, all set up for the ceremony. We got the Everse 8 today. We're running two lavalier mics off the Sennheiser EWDX. And um, it's gonna be a beautiful day. We're getting started. Stick around. Okay, so we're all set up for the ceremony here in the little chapel. We're gonna run back up to the carriage house, make sure everything's set there. Not much storage, so we had to put our cases and bags and stuff back in the van, but we're gonna double check, make sure we're cleaned up up here, make sure everything's working. Got the lights all programmed up, the movers all programmed with sound switch. Um, basic setup, same as usual in here, Astera. AX1 pixel tubes. We got the Bun Gear Command Center, by the way. Order yours now. And we've got the uh, Electro Voice Evolve 50s, um, both lighting, moving heads, pop-up totems. Um, basically the rig we use almost every weekend. Nice little alcove in here, you'll see, and um, perfect setup for a DJ, quite frankly. It's a small room and we may, because there's kind of a little L-shaped spot, we may put another speaker over there just so that those people can hear a little bit better for toasts because they're kind of around the corner. Uh, but you'll see, man, they've got a lot going on today. I'm pretty sure the bride's coming in on a white horse and buggy. Uh, they got a, a live painter. If you've never seen one of those, we'll get a shot of her starting that painting here. Uh, and then the, the finished product we'll show you as well. They've got a 360 booth over beside us. Uh, they got a monogram projection. I mean, she went all out. I gotta give her props. So uh, this should be a good wedding for Jerry Lynn and William, um, man, don't know what to expect. Play looks, looks fire, quite frankly. Uh, looks like a lot of stuff that I don't get to play very often. So, man, I don't know, stick around. We're gonna see where this one goes because we've never been here before and we don't know what to expect. Let's go. Okay, so we're suited up, ready to go, about, I don't know, 30 minutes from ceremony time. Here we are inside the main ballroom, inside the carriage, whatever they call it, carriage hall or something like that, where the party's gonna be, where the dinner's gonna be. Uh, like I said, we got our standard system here. Uh, room small enough, 150 people, two evolves are gonna be plenty for this, but uh, we were just double checking, putting all of our gear away, doing any last minute prep, making sure the CO2 cannon's hooked up and everything's programmed. Everything seems to be good in here. We got all the cases, like I said, in the van, suits on. I think we're gonna head back to the ceremony site, find the groom, find the efficient, get them mic'd up, and then wait for that to start. We're not doing the music today. Uh, you'll see they have a harpist playing the music. And um, so we're off the hook on music and the music cues. So that's kind of a little bit of a relief. I can see guests starting to show up a little bit early today. And, um, and then we're also not doing the cocktail hour, which it's gonna be, I think, right outside on this porch. Uh, very pretty day today, like I said, and I think the lady playing the harp is playing that as well. So let's head back to the ceremony site and get ready to get started.
Okay, folks, so we are back inside the main hall. Everybody is outside enjoying cocktail hour, as you just saw. I'm in here just kind of going over the names. When I tell you this is a huge wedding party, it is a huge wedding party. I think it's 28 or 30 people. Luckily, I'm doing first names only, but all in all, ceremony went great. Had a lavalier mic on the efficient, lavalier mic on the groom. Everything went great. And uh, as you saw, if you're gonna show up, show up in style, did the old uh, white horse, white buggy, uh, pulled up and then they both left in it. And um, so again, we're just waiting for cocktail hour to end. Then we get introduction started in just a few minutes. And um, I'm about ready to get things started, going right into the first dance after that. I think they're actually doing the cake cutting after the first dance, dinner, and then more things later. Stick around. <music> And now, ladies and gentlemen, please stand on your feet. It is my pleasure to introduce your bride and groom, Mr. and Mrs. Blanks. Here we are, end of the night. You saw the dancing footage, great party, great little room, lights look killer in here because everything is super white. Man, can't complain, totally different playlist than I usually play. A uh, little bit more R&B, a little bit more kind of Southern hip hop, I guess. I don't know, man. Great night, beautiful day. We had a good time trying to pack up and get out of here. Load out is a little bit tough. We'll see uh, if we can get the van close enough. But uh, man, thank you guys for watching. As always, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, give it a big old thumbs up. Good night.